Hello friends, today's video is gonna be about my pretty new planner. Here I'm using the bullet journal system. Many of you maybe already know that I've made videos about weekly update in my Midori Traveler's Notebook as memory keeper of my weekly activities. But for the real planning, I have used uh, my Hobonichi A6. But in the end, I realized that that is too small for me to do all the planning things and write down all my appointments. I just need more space to write down, so I end up with the bullet journal. I've got inspired from Boho Berries. You guys should check her out. She has a really great YouTube channel, so yeah, I've got this dotted Leuchtturm with azure color. This one is blue one. It has 249 pages. I actually love the azure color, but I think I was just bored with the plain cover, so I did some change here. I had put a design paper and laminated it to change the background and I also had used a texture paper right here if you guys can see it because I love this flowery and the paper texture and I also think it's pretty and I've also got this big bear I found him on Pinterest and I really love it and again I had laminated it to protect them because I always bring this book with me when I go outside so let's get started it is still not too much to show you guys because I've been started using it on February this year so if you open it up you first see this bunny I also get her from Pinterest and she says hi and here you can also write all personal things like name address in case you lost the book and in this second page it is still blank but I already have some idea to put some pictures of me of and my husband and maybe later uh, with our baby because we are expecting the baby coming in April so Next is the index pages. Uh, it has three pages for index. Yeah, one, two, three. And here I did some decoration with washi tape and picture from Pinterest. It is about the verse from uh, the Bible. In the next section, I write down visit schedule of my parents and my in-law because they're, they will come to visit us in April and May. And then I have the calendar of 2016 like everybody else has. And here I just do some future plan using color coding some friends and my brother's readings they have orange heart and I also mark the holy day in 2016 with purple and I also using the blue color to track my husband's work schedule here so I know when he has the work off I also put this uh, blue guy to mark the calendar so it is easier to find it later. Next page is my pregnancy lock. I like to count uh, the day when my baby will be arrived and I also write down the doctor appointment and vitamin that I've got from the doctor and anything else I've experience on my pregnancy here like when I've got nausea when I first feel the baby movement and I also have some notes here 
It's all about the baby things. Yeah, that's about the pregnancy journal. And here I have list my morning routines and also the key to the bullet journal. And here is the first time I trying to use the bullet journal system. At first it looks really messy because I am trying all the layout that works for me. So at first in February I have here my morning routine trackers and then my weekly spread right here. I just write down my expenses of the day and here I also have the medication tracker for me and my husband and I also list tasks to be done in the in this weeks and I also track my social media right here and what to buy And here I've list all books we have here and I've marked it when I have already finished read them. And here I've list all books we have and I have marked it when I finished them or if it's still in progress and I also get this uh this little frog right here so I can find the book list quickly actually I can see it also on the index pages but to have this guy in my notebooks makes me happy and the top tabs here I think it is really nice to have it in my notebooks Here, this is also my book list, and here the cleaning tracker for Febru month February. At first, I won't do much decoration on this planner because I think I'm going to use it as functional planner. But in the end, I cannot help myself and still do some decoration. I think much decoration here to make it cuter and prettier. Next is my monthly review on February. I also list all my appoint appointments here and events in February or things to be done or some memory keeper for important things. And here I want to write down all my favorite things, but it's still in progress. I will definitely come back to fill this page in. Here I list all things we have to buy for our baby. Yeah, just for the baby things, so I won't forget to buy him something nice here is a verse from the bible because i am trying to read bible every day and i just write down the first i read on that day and this is the second attempt uh, of my weekly spread and it is also failed because i don't like the layout here and it didn't really work for me so I'm, I've made some doodling here. And here I try to track my social media, like my YouTube channel and Instagram. And here I list all my wish list and use this pretty pic to bring the luck and hope someday I could check them all because in Germany they are using pig as a lucky charm like bring a good luck 
something like that. Here I, we list our favorite boys and girls name for our baby later. And this is the third attempt to uh, make the layout of weekly spread. It worked really good until now but in the end I just added some more um, things like in here I list the weather and the temperature on that day and I also write down the, uh, the expenses of the day and what we've, we've got for dinner something like that and some notes for next appointment Here I list all the place I have visited and this one is so personal that's why I cover it up. It's about the task we are doing. And here I just make some doodle and this one is also the weekly spread. Here I added um, the time when I woke up and when I went to bed also still the weather and the temperature temperature expenses and some memori memory memory of the day and what to buy something like that Here is also pretty still the same layout, but um, but I try to make week on two pages right now, Monday until su Sunday. I can look it better, and I just write down the quote of the weeks. And again, I use stickers and washi tape. <laughs> To decorate it. For the new month, I always make some extra page to decorate it just to mark so I know that it's the new month like that so, <laughs> because I really like, like to decorate the pages right here and I also have this uh, mark some pitch mark right here to mark the new month this is for March and for April I already made it so in this month it is more organized because I already know what list I really want to have and the layout and so on like in this March at first page I have the monthly review I also list all the things uh, I have to do in this month and I list all the appointment and events right here it is pretty much the same uh, like another monthly review I also have the daily Bible fairs and my routine activity tracker here. I use this mark because I always have to get here every day. And here is the weekly review. Uh, weekly spread one week in two pages the layout is pretty much the same but I added here the YouTube and the Instagram tracker and this I just write down the recipes I found in internet 
what I like about the bullet journal and this notebook is I can do anything I want in the next page. I can change the layout of my spread as I want. It really gives me more, much flexibility. So I really love this bullet journal system until now. And again, this is the weekly spread. I add this uh, column to write down all the things to buy and I've also made the meals planned right here, the social media tracker and yeah it's pretty much the same when the time when I woke up and when I went to bed something like that and some memorize and the weather and I also have an extra column for notes yeah this is also the same layout like this one and again I try I always decorated it with washi tape page flag stickers and some doodling right here I also use this um, page mark to just to show the current day like today is Wednesday 23rd so it is right here it is pretty much what I have right now on my Leuchtturm and yeah this is uh, the day the weeks until the end of the March and again I have one page extra for decorating for April right here and yeah that's all what I've got right now and next is still blank maybe I can I will uh, do some update about my bullet journal and maybe some of you will be interested to sh see the videos so you guys it's very welcome to subscribe to my channel and until then I wish you all have a nice day. Bye.